to accompany me across the ice cap to retrieve the final expedition. So what makes a good adventure movie? These outdoor films and documentaries, ranging from life-affirming epics to documentaries charting human endurance, will inspire you out of hibernation. At the time of writing, they can all be found on Netflix for your immediate escapism. Looking through a few of these movies, there are some truly epic tales of survival and astonishing feats of human endurance, all of which have followed the central theme of humans' hardwired passion to explore to some of the most remote locations on Earth. So take a seat, grab the popcorn, and get stuck into our list of the best adventure movies on Netflix. <laughs> Let's go. Wait, wait, wait. Before getting into the video, don't forget to subscribe and like our channel. Sorry, sorry, just kidding. The <laughs> damn. Ah, really nice. Number 1. Tate Gailed, A Hard Journey 2023. In the autumn of 2021 Will Renwick ran every mountain in Wales. Join him on a preview of the short film covering this incredible endeavor. When Will set out on this challenge, he had no expectation of completing. A solo and self-supported 500-mile run taking in all 189 of Wales mountains. It soon transpired, however, that positivity, determination and the will to support an important cause would carry him far further than he could ever have imagined. You can actually watch the whole of this 22-minute film on YouTube for free. It shows Will Renwick's attempt to climb every single mountain in Wales, all 189 of them, in one single solo and self-supported run with all his camping kit on his back. If you like people defying the odds films, this is absolutely one for you. But Will Rennick has finally completed his epic challenge to run up every mountain over 2,000 feet in Wales. That's a total of 189. Number 2. Against the Ice is a 2022 historical survival film. Against the Ice is based on the true story of Denmark's 1909 polar expedition to discover records left behind by a previously unsuccessful expedition in Greenland. These records will essentially prove whether America or Denmark has claim in this part of the Arctic, so, as you can imagine, the stakes are pretty high. In short, the film involves two men, an angry-looking polar bear, and many, many months spent battling the life-threatening elements of the Arctic. Along with some stunning visuals, expect a whole lot of grueling tension, gory fight scenes, and moments of sheer desperation that leave you hanging on by a thread. No one is coming to get you. You're going to die up here. You might freeze to death. Stop. Number 3. Broad Peak is a 2022 Polish biographical adventure drama film. Broad Peak is based on the extraordinary life of Polish mountaineer and guide, Maciej Berbika. Having accomplished, what he thought was, the first winter ascent of Broad Peak, AD 47M, in 1988, Maciej later learns he was 17 meters lower than the true summit. 25 years later, he returns to finish what he started. With stunning cinematography and an all-immersive sound experience, this one's pretty good at sticking to the facts while still continuing to keep you gripped. Though incredibly tense and harrowing in parts, there's also tender moments littered throughout, and a nice bit of insight into Maciej himself. <laughs> Number 4. American sports documentary film directed by Ian Derry. It was released on Netflix on May 3, 2022. If you didn't already know, Johanna Nordblad is a Finnish freediver perhaps best known for breaking the women's dynamic freediving record in 2004, along with the women's Guinness World Record for diving 50 meters under 2 degrees Celsius cold water with just a swimsuit and mask. In a The Ice Dive Endeavor, however, she attempts to break the world record for distance traveled under ice with one breath. Pretty impressive huh? While following her journey leading up to this latest world record attempt, Hold Your Breath also takes you through Johanna's impressive life prior to free driving, including what led her to cold water swimming in the first place. Number 5. The River Runner 2021. 
The story of Scott Lindgren's 20-year quest to be the first person to paddle the four great rivers that originate from Tibet's sacred Mount Kailash is more than a gripping whitewater flick. It is also an intimate chronicle of an emotionally stunted athlete who's having a breakthrough after a life crisis. As a highly accomplished expedition kayaker and whitewater filmmaker, Lindgren always forbade any sign of emotional vulnerability on the river, he saw it as a weakness that might jeopardize the fortitude needed for extreme waters. It takes a life-changing diagnosis, followed by a dark night of the soul, for him to finally learn how to show up with an open heart. Number 6. 14 Peaks, Nothing is Impossible is a 2021 documentary film. This is another one of those climbing documentaries that's well and truly broken into the mainstream. It follows Nepalese climber, Nims Perja, the Ayusain Bolt of 8,000-meter peaks, as he attempts to become the fastest person to summit all 14 of the world's highest mountains. The record to beat? Seven years. His target? Seven months. As well as following this incredible quest, the film also shines a light on the mistreatment of Sherpa climbers within Nepal in recent mountaineering history. Why, asks Nims, do Western mountaineers often neglect to even afford their fellow Nepalese climbers the dignity of being identified by their name in post-expedition reports? Those guys are really, really risking their lives. Number 7. Last Breath is a 2019 British documentary film. Okay, boys, take it down now. Yeah, if nail-biting documentaries are your thing, this one will be right up your street. A deep sea diver is stranded on the seabed with five minutes of oxygen and no hope of rescue. With access to amazing archive this is the story of one man's impossible fight for survival. Last Breath follows the true story of diver Chris Lemons as he had his umbilical cable accidentally severed 100 meters under the sea. Trapped without heat, light and communication, the documentary uses real-life footage and audio recordings to retell the rescue mission, including harrowing descriptions of how to it feels to be utterly alone in the deep depths of the sea. Number 8. Our Planet is a British nature documentary series made for Netflix. Explores and unravels the mystery of how and why animals migrate, showing some of the most dramatic and compelling stories in the natural world through spectacular and innovative cinematography. David Attenborough's soothing sounds had once only been available to hear if you had access to the BBC's Planet Earth series, which was frustratingly only free online to people living in the UK on the BBC iPlayer. Now, Attenborough is available for the whole world, the Netflix world, to listen to via the all-new nature documentary Our Planet, an eight-part series exploring some of the world's remaining wilderness areas and the creatures within them. It received widespread critical acclaim on its release and has since been nominated for a whopping 10 Emmy Awards. Number 9. Lorena, Lightfooted Woman 2019. This here is a cracking documentary about a long distance runner called Lorena Ramirez, a young woman of the Raramuri, a group of indigenous American people living in Chihuahua, Mexico. Amongst other things, the Raramuri are well known for their long distance running abilities, something Lorena happens to excel at. Directed by Juan Carlos Rulfo, the film follows Lorena's daily life in the Sierra Tarahumara mountain range, along with her neonate training rituals and the ultra-marathons she enters around the world. Aside from winning three of these marathons by the age of 22, and, well, being astonishingly good at running, Lorena also happens to accomplish all of this in sandals. Number 10. Resurface is a 2017 short documentary film about a veteran who was on the verge of suicide before finding an outlet in the form of surfing. A deeply moving documentary, this is a must-watch. Backed by research detailing the healing properties of the ocean on the mind and body, Van Carreza founded Operation Surf, vowing to dedicate his life to helping veterans find peace through surfing. Little did he know the life-changing effects this would have on Iraq War veteran Bobby Lane who had been suffering for years with PTSD and depression. Resurface follows Bobby's journey, the stories of other veterans and their struggles, and the unbelievable power of the ocean. See you again. It was like death and destruction and hell. The ocean is the one place I can go to for peace.